me and Jeezy were actually supposed to do a project together called Best of Both Hoods. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Jeezy kind of, he took off, you know what I'm saying? And he, he got real big. I don't want to say he got like, I mean, basically the mixtape didn't happen. He kind of, you know I mean, we, me and Jeezy did about four records, then he kind of got real big, whatever. We didn't, we didn't, we didn't do the mixtape. Uh, Wayne are. called me up and said, yo, what's up with the tape you supposed to be doing with Jeezy? I said, I don't know, man. You know, Jeezy's, Jeezy's moving. He's doing a lot of things right now. He's, you know what I'm saying? He said, man, what's up? Let, let, if you want to do it, let's do the tape. But let's do the tape together, me and you. Mm. And from there, just so happens, the next month, we wound up going on tour together. Me, Lil Wayne, Chris Brown, and um, the Franchise Boys, and Neil at that time. We, came, we went on tour and me and Wayne just got super close. We did a bunch of records on tour. Wayne yeah. is a studio rat. So after the shows, we, Wayne always had the studio booked. Mm -hmm. Me and him would go to the studio, record, we recorded so much music. We just became super close. Mm -hmm. And that's been my brother ever since. This is Bryce Davis on the check-in. And you heard Joel's talking about doing a project with Jeezy back in the early 2000s. I actually remember them dropping a few tracks together. Uh, one of my favorites is off the DJ Clue album, the uh, Fuck Off Joint. I remember hearing that in the club and dating back in the day. But anyway, um, one thing I'm a little annoyed about, though, I ain't gonna lie. You know, I used to be a real big Joel Santana fan. Is It seems like since he's got out of jail, all these interviews have came up. And it's uh, talking about a lot of old stuff. The whole I can't feel my face with Wayne that had us all super hyped. Them two were definitely on fire back in the day, but you know, it's almost like what I said about Dr. Dre. Like, when can we start hearing some new music? You know what I mean? Like, I like that Flex called him out and was like, yo, put out music. Like, we all know Joel gets busy in the studio. We all know that he got mad tracks, but for whatever reason, like, they just never come out. Like, you know, I heard him say stuff like, uh, when they took his hard drive, he had hundreds of songs recorded that were never put out. And so I know he got the work ethic, and you know what I mean? So I don't understand why we don't never get no music from him. It's to the point now where I damn near don't even care for real, because, you know, uh, you know, it, I mean, he's just inconsistent that long, you know? And I don't know his personal situation, you know? Like, I think uh, he got off probation. I don't know how that affects, you know, music. You know, we're just happy with anything, for real, for real. So hopefully you get some new music coming soon. And if you like the video, make sure you like and subscribe.